you doing? Is that your second or third drink? Listen, listen. My voice was a little tight, and I thought I'd have something to drink to loosen it up. I wonder if that's what your mother said in the old days when she was a singer and a drop cook. Look, I told you I'm not like my mother. Now, don't, Aunt Liz. Just don't lecture me, please. Honey, I... I don't mean to lecture you, but you are worrying me. I know you're going through a terrible time right now, and I know your emotions are raw. But you need to talk to somebody. It doesn't have to be me. Thank you. Thank you. I will think about that. Sweetheart, don't turn to alcohol instead. Find a way to deal with this pain now. I'd hate to see you wind up in rehab in a few years. Wendy, honey, don't try to drown your troubles in alcohol. Look, I told you, I'm not my mother. And I'm handling my problems. As a matter of fact, I'm handling my problems just fine. Besides, you know what? You have no idea what I've been through. So don't try to counsel me, okay? I do know what you've been through, Whitney. Getting pregnant with Fox's baby. Finding out that Chad is your brother and then trying to put it all behind you by putting the baby up for adoption. And then you find out that Chad adopted your baby without your knowledge. Honey, God knows anyone would need help after going through all that. Hmm. And you don't know the half of it. I'm pregnant with my brother's baby. What am I gonna do? Trust me, you have no idea what I've been through. Whitney, if, if there's more to what you've been through, then tell me. Talk to me. Let me try and help. That's just it. No one can help me. I just got to move on with my life, and that's all there is to it. Anyway, I am grateful to you for giving me a place to work, a place to sing. Because when I'm on stage, I forget all about my life, and um, I feel alive again. Thank you. Whitney, please, just don't turn to drugs and alcohol to make yourself feel better. That's the road that your mother took, and that is a dead end. Liz, the manager needs you in back to sign some checks. Okay, thank you. We'll talk later. Mm. What the hell's the matter with you, huh? Are you crazy? I know it was you, Fox. You tried to destroy my files. I tr what do you mean, tried? It didn't work. Nothing was destroyed. Huh. What the hell are you doing here anyway, huh? Where's my son? Well, my son's at home. Someone's watching him. So you just dumped him with a babysitter, Chad? Is that it? You sick of playing dad already? Chad is a great father. Oh. Chad, Fox, what is going on? I don't know what's going on. Liz's maniac just attacked me out of the blue. Oh, please, you know damn well why. Stop it. I know you two have problems, but you can't fight it out here. You know what? You should both leave. But we just got here. Listen, you, you can't have a brawl here. It's bad for business. Now, you're welcome to come back another night, but call for reservations first, please. Come on. Um, what about our champagne? We are celebrating. And this is the first break Chaz had since he got his son. Is that, it's my son. I'm... Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Whitney Russell.